Two ultra-Orthodox brothers have become Israel's latest reality rock stars after they dominated the stage at auditions for Israel's rising star. Ari and Gilgit received tens of thousands of votes from fans after they performed a cover of the Eagles' classic hit, Hotel California. Israelis commonly perceive members of the ultra-Orthodox Jewish minority to be opposed to secular life, but these two are looking to break down these stereotypes. The power of music is above everything, and we see over the last 50 to 60 years in the music industry, since they started recording music, when we listen to songs from 40 years ago, and we get excited, or from 50 years ago, when there were no video clips or MTV, and all these media. I'm not a man of light, flashes, and sparkles. I'm ready to stand. I say that in the spiritual sense, with what I have, without external outfits, and I believe that if it's good, it will sell, and if not, then not. The brothers, who played in traditional ultra-Orthodox attire, claim that they don't even own a television. Regardless, they've managed to rake in more than 80 percent of the votes from those tuning in. The show's four judges also seem convinced. Think about how many people in the world of entertainment started with a weird look and became the biggest stars. Think about it. Now, these are not people with agents and the story and someone who pushed them and photographed them for a photo book. And you know what? Even caused some provocation. You are taking people from the periphery, from his life, his surrounding, his belief, and he comes and sings. Even though it's a huge commercial show, it's naive. Ultra-Orthodox Jews make up some 10 percent of the 8 million people in Israel. The group has become increasingly aggressive in their attempt to impose their traditions on the public. The brothers have not informed any of their children on their TV presence, and they say that only a few of their close friends are aware of what they are doing.